We call the double thumb swing back. with the Dark Hour, second edition. I have here in my hands a flyer to a couple of killer shows. Cannibal Corpse, Cynic, Sinister, and Horror, Tuesday, June 14th, All Ages event. It's a must-see. First time Sinister's ever been here. It's probably, I don't know about the last, but it's a crazy opportunity. You can't miss it, man. We've also got Malevolent, Malevolent Creation, Living Sacrifice, Crimson Thorn, and Apostasy on Monday, May 23rd is an All Ages event. And then later on in the evening, ID show would be Living Sacrifice, Sick, and Dominion with the Dollar Tap Beers, which is also a good event. Um, we're here today in the studio. We're just hanging out for the second show. Um, check this out. 
That's me. Um, we're here because we had a we had a couple interviews lined up. We had, we did one with Horror and Necromus, both killer local bands, but not everybody involved was happy with how they turned out. So turn this off. Um, so we're doing this, we're kicking this, and we're gonna reschedule those interviews, which went really well. You know, and I, I want to thank the guys. They're really cool. They're really easy to get along with, and we appreciate that a lot. Um, we just checked out Scum, Napalm Death live video from the album Scum, killer song, killer album, <laughs> killer video, and we also had Mitch Harris doing the old double form kickback, whatever, we thought we'd throw something a little silly in there for you. Um, like I said, check out the Cannibal Corpse video, video, check out the Cannibal Corpse show on Tuesday, June 14th, we'll be back at you, you got some videos from Revenant and Winter coming up, so stick around, hang out, and thanks for tuning in.
We're back with the dark hour. We're here on our second show, our studio report, so to speak. Um, got one more show to tell you about. It's the Minneapolis Memorial Day Metal Massacre, brought to you by Shock Theater and Mr. Decker, who brings you pretty much every good death metal show you're ever going to see in Minneapolis, every death metal show for that matter. Got to say thanks to him. Keep up the good work. It's not an easy job, but somebody's got to do it, and you're doing it well. Um, some of the bands at the Memorial Day Metal Massacre are going to be Necromas Horror, Flesh Grind, Dysphoria, Oppressor, a lot of good bands, probably about 35 of them or so, so that'll be a really cool show. Um, we just checked out Ride from Cathedral, from their newest offering on disc. Um, I'm sitting here with this kind of, the thing behind me here is Tommy Danger, he's, he's helping me run the show here. He's got his own show, High Voltage, which also appears on this fine channel, so I'd like to say thanks to Tom for being here. He needs a haircut, but hey. Tommy got some good news today. He's uh, going to have the Metallica interview in Wisconsin when they play. Yeah. When they play Metallica. When they play wherever. But uh, we got some more videos coming at you. I'd like to. Well, you'll just see you later. We'll talk to you. Stay the black.
We're back. Um, we just checked out a video from Hypocrisy titled Left to Rot. We played it on our first show. We played it on this show. I like the video quite a bit. I like the band quite a bit. Um, before I go on to anything else, I want to say I got a lot of thanks to say to some people. I want to say thanks to Tommy and Sandy and Kim for all helping me out and all that. And Kim setting up the interviews, Tommy and Sandy for all the technical stuff. That's real cool of them. Um, I'd like to say thanks to Mike Paradise for helping carry in the equipment for our Entombed video. Entombed video, I should say, Entombed interview. Yeah. There's Thomas. Um, when we did the Entombed interview, that was real cool. I want to say thanks to Paul Bragelman. He helped us out. He helped carry the equipment. We were supposed to do a Demented Ted interview when they are here, but they showed up late. So we did a Horror and Necromus interview, as I mentioned later, which everybody wasn't happy with. So we got to do it over again. I'm just kidding. Um, so I, you know, gotta say thanks to Paul. I want to say thanks to Horan and Necromus for being real cool about the interview. I want to say thanks to Nick A. Anderson from Entombed. I'd also like to, you know, we we're gonna start doing demo reviews and all that stuff. And um, I send out tons of letters to tons of bands in the underground, and uh, not many have responded yet, which is pretty lame, I think. But um, you know, I suppose I, I suppose they could be thinking it's a rip off or something. They really don't know who we are, so I understand that, you know, but. But if you want to go somewhere, you got to give some effort, which kind of sucks that they're not. But some guys that have responded that I'd like to say thanks to for writing back are Chuka from Horror of Horrors, Buddy Mitchell of Drogheda and Phobophobia, who is a really cool guy, who we're going to be reviewing both of his demos probably next time around. Um, Brian Ronquist from Crucifer actually sent us a video, but there was something wrong with the tape, so we're not getting to show that. He sent me a new one and probably a video interview. Brian's a real cool guy. He's helping us out, you know. He's, they got some cool stuff, and they're up and coming. I want to say thanks to Black from Angel Kill. He sent us his demo. We're going to be reviewing that next week. Um, yes. Pete from Order from Chaos. He's, I don't know what's up with him. He's kind of psycho, I guess. But um, 
you know, he said if I send him a tape, we'll get a video, we'll get, you know, a live show from them, so we're going to do that gig, and I'd also like to say thanks to Steve from Nuclear Death, who at this time doesn't, they got a lot of albums in that, we're probably going to do a, no, I shouldn't say albums, but we'll probably review them in the up and coming weeks or whatever. Um, all right, we're going to get back to some video mayhem. We're, we're going to do a monstrosity video, which is real cool for final cremation. Um, we're also going to do a couple, so we're going to do a Mashuga and a Fetish 69 video. Neither one of them really fall into the death metal category, but I think they're worth checking out. Mashuga is more of a kind of, uh, maybe techno thrash, you might call them. Fetish 69 is just different, man, but they're really cool, so check it out. Um, and back, I kind of forgot to do something here, but... Uh, do it now. Um, for the demo, you know, if you guys got demos, show ideas, anything, live clips, you know, any bands, whatever, you want to show your artwork or show anything, send it to... The best thing is to send it to my address which is that's me right there in the red um <laughs> send it to me because it'll probably get here quicker or get to me quicker than if you sent it to the studio but if you want to send it to the studio we'll have that address at the end of the show we'll also have the viewer comment line but uh whatever somebody's looking in the window at us man I, we're gonna go beat the hell out of them so we're gonna kick in some videos here comes monstrosity check it out it's pretty happening later kid <laughs>
Hey, what's up? This is Rob again. I hope you know that by now. That was a flick that you just checked out. Pretty cool tune, you know. They don't totally fit into the death metal genre, but, you know, they're cool. Um, anyways, just like to tell you thanks for stopping in. I'd like to thank everybody that helped me out today. I already named you all, and I ain't going to do it again because that's a waste of my time and, well, not money, but anyways. Um, also, on a reminder, Minneapolis Memorial Day Metal Massacre, bada boom, bada bing with lots of good bands, some of them inclu including Necromus Horror, Flesh Grind, Dysphoria, Oppressor, Phantasm, Suffer, Epitaph, Xenomorph, Ophidian, and just a whole bucket load. It's just going to be insanity. Also, um, don't forget about the Campbell Corpse Cynic Sinister Horror Show, Tuesday, June 14th. Ding, ding, ding. And Malevolent Creation, Living Sacrifice, Crimson Dorn, and Apostasy. So you got a bunch of good shows coming up. You want to thank Shock Theater for... Bleh. Shock Theater Productions for bringing all these killer bands to town. Um, that's about it. Thanks for tuning in. This week's credit roll music, courtesy of Seance, off the album Salt Rubbed Eyes, and it is the third track on the CD, also titled, entitled, Salt Rubbed Eyes. Killer band, check them out. They, you'll hear for yourself.